Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, as expected, last night, Global got a new data download to prepare for the release of the MUI Goku and SSP of Vegeta to all Dokkan Fest banners. And today, as always, we're gonna check out exactly what we got and hopefully answer a question that I have been asked approximately 5 million times since the anniversary started, which is, when are the banners gonna be dropping? So with that said, let's uh, jump right into it. And before we take a look at the assets, I wanna give a quick shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting them. As you guys can see, he is very close to a thousand followers. So if you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. He does a lot for the community and I think he definitely deserves it. So let's get him there as quickly as possible. All right, so uh, now let's scroll down a little bit and see what's going on. And the first thing we have is a very, very welcome sight. We have your Dokkan Festival A and Dokkan Festival B tickets. And as I've said before, I expected them, but I wasn't 100% sure. And because they introduced those rainbow tickets this year, I was honestly a bit nervous that they would just do away with the Dokkan Fest A and Dokkan Fest B tickets altogether. But I mean, it shouldn't really come as a huge surprise because I think they know that Global would have rioted if uh, they did that. You know, there would have been an, an uproar. We would have been, you know, signing, signing petitions, storming the Bandai HQ in Japan because uh, they just can't take that away from us. Like we're used to having these tickets. If they took them away, that would not have been okay. But that rhymed. Anyways, uh, we got the tickets, guys. We got the tickets. So when we do summons on the Goku and Vegeta banners, respectively, we will be getting extra tickets for some extra summons, which is amazing. And then moving on, we got some translations for a bunch of things related to the revival skills. And I know they're not the best quality, but in the game, they'll look just fine. And, uh, oh, let me actually click on the thread here. Okay, so we got that. And, uh, oh, you know what? I think we got a little bit messed up, so let me actually go to the top here. We got, of course, the AGLLR MUI Goku. And we also have the SSB Vegeta. Oh, sorry, no, this is also Goku. So the first one was his SSR form. This is the TUR form. And then we have the LR form. There's Goku. I'm pretty sure the guy that most people are going for. And then we have uh, oh some other labels for Goku. And then we're moving on to Vegeta. There's his SSR form. I gotta say, man, the SSR forms for both Goku and Vegeta look really, really dope. Um, I almost like the arts better than the LR arts, to be honest. But anyways, uh, we got the SSR Vegeta, we got the TUR Vegeta, and finally, we have LR Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. And of course, Vegeta does have that extra costume effect where his shirt comes off, or his uh, armor comes off. And uh, some more labels here for the Saiyan Prince. And after that, we have the side units. So this is for the Tech Ultimate Gohan and Piccolo. And of course, that is the TUR with Piccolo in the art. And then the other side unit is the STR Angel Golden Frieza and also Ultimate Gohan. So Gohan is in both side units. A little bit weird, but it's fine, I guess. I was hoping for a Kaba though. I'm not gonna lie. Like back in the day, before uh, you know the anniversary started on JP, I was really hoping that Vegeta's banner would have a side unit Kaba because we don't have a lot of Kabas in this game, man. In fact, we only have like one summonable one on the support banner, which you can almost never get, and then the free to play one, right? The tech one, and that's it. So we need more Kaba love, but uh, not this time, I guess. Although it would have been the perfect opportunity. To put Kappa in there, but I guess it's Universe 7 themed, so it makes sense, I guess. Whatever. Okay, 
And then we have the Dokkan Awakening or Dokkan Events level for, uh, I think this might be Goku? Oh yeah, this is for Goku. Okay, so there's the uh, event stage, pretty cool in my opinion. And then there's the Goku uh, medal for his Dokkan Awakening. And then we have the Vegeta medal or Vegeta level and then the Vegeta medal for his uh, LR Awakening once again. And then this is the translations for revival skill labels. So just some in-game assets here, which you will see um, on the, you know, Vegeta and uh, Goku cards, respectively. And I think that might be it. Okay, so quick summary. Let's go to the top here. Dokkan Battle Global data download for July 8th, 2021, which is today. Translated assets, AGL, LR, MUI, Goku, Int, LR, Super Saiyan Blue, Evolution, Vegeta, Tech, Ultimate Gohan, and Piccolo. STR Angel Golden Frieza and Ultimate Gohan, Dokkan Awakening events, and also uh, Awakening Medals, Revival Skill Labels, and new Dokkan Festival tickets A and B, which is awesome. And of course, like I said, let's answer that question that I have been asked literally thousands of times since the anniversary began on like every single stream, like every other question is when other banners coming out, when other banners dropping, when can I summon for Goku and Vegeta? Well, now we have our answer. And as you can see from the countdown on the Dokkan Wiki, we are less than 12 hours away, guys. Okay, so by the time I drop this video, it should be roughly noon time, Eastern time, okay? And the banners are dropping a little bit earlier than normal, actually. They're dropping at 11 p.m. Eastern time or 8 p.m. Pacific time. So yesterday, I gave a guess when people asked me, I was like, it's probably gonna be the normal time of like 11.30 p.m. Pacific time or 2.30 a.m. Eastern time. So that's not the case. They are releasing it about three and a half hours earlier than your standard banner release time. So once again, it's gonna be 11 p.m. Eastern time, 8 p.m. Pacific time, or about 11 hours after this video is released. So hopefully people can uh, be happy with that. Hopefully I won't be getting the same question a million times, although I'm sure people are still gonna ask. Um, I'm probably gonna stream a little bit before the banners drop just to you know, finish farming a few events and get people excited. So look forward to that in a couple hours. And then of course, when the banners drop, we're also gonna be streaming for uh, the live summons. It's gonna be awesome. My girlfriend, Android18, or Taya, will be there as well, so definitely look out for that. And yeah, that's it. I guess that's all there is to say, guys. Hope you're stoked. Hope you're excited. These banners are coming, okay? And uh, I'm ready. Whether it's gonna be Shaft or, or Glory, uh, whether it's gonna be pain or or happiness, I'm I'm ready for it all, man. I'm just ready to go. I'm ready to summon. I've waited long enough, so uh, let's get it, guys. Okay, so that is gonna do it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you very soon. And uh, as always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video and. If it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. Hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.